Hi, Mr. and Mrs. Green. Thanks for coming to your presentation today. We're going to go over your floor plan, um, which we discussed earlier. I'm actually going to move on to your elevation now and talk about the elements of the design plan today. The first thing you're going to notice in your elevation is we have a double bowl vanity with the two separate mirrors, your GFCI rated outlets, some ADA compliant faucets because you had mentioned that you were having some problems with your hands and we're going to go over those faucets as well. An ADA compliant toilet and then over here you'll see to your bathtub area the chandelier actually hangs over the middle part of the bathroom not exactly over the tub which would not be a safety issue. Your glassed in shower with a seat as well. Okay so let's move on to the design. We talked a lot about you wanting a beach seaside feel and so that was really important for us to do for you. So we're going to talk about the elements and details that are going to go on within your space based on the concept that we came up with on a beach design that was also uh, handicapped accessible and some place that you felt you could age um, as time went by. We're going to start out with a textured piece of stone that we're going to lay in the bottom of the shower. This is a slip resistant surface which will give you a safety factor. We're going to move on to the vanity area which is going to actually have two glass hand blown vessel bowls that you had talked about that you had seen when you were out shopping with a friend one day. We were able to locate those bowls. The seashell that you see over here is actually a vessel bowl drain and this is the element that we can actually put on it to carry through that seaside feel. The elements in the space are going to be fixtures and faucets within your units that are from Growy. And again, they are ADA compliant. They're very easy to use and they have a smooth closed feature to be able to turn them on and off. The lighting elements are going to follow the same line detail as you see in a geometric type shape here, repeated again in your sconces. Then we move on to the toilet area. It's an ADA compliant toilet, comfort height, easy to flush, 1.6 gallons so there's no water waste. The other, other item that I wanted to talk about is the walk-in tub that we had discussed. And this, of course, will be so that you'll have access to bathe and have privacy when you do bathe. And again, we're still going to be using the fixtures that repeat from that growy um, group of items that we had decided on for selections. We have a chenille fabric that's going to go on your lounge chair in that space. This will be a chair that you can sit on to change your socks, get ready for bed, lotion your legs. It'll be a nice soft chenille fabric. And again, the coral pattern is repeated. And you'll also see on the feature wall, we're also going to follow through with a coral pattern wallpaper. The other elements I wanted to talk about were a lot of the natural elements we're going to scatter throughout the space so that we can repeat this beautiful element of beach and serene bathing. Um, some of the elements are, again, those repeated corals. We kept the colors very light and bright so that it would be a very happy but tranquil place for you to be able to use as a sanctuary. We hope that you're happy with the design. We put a lot of time into it. If you have any questions whatsoever, please feel free to just ask us. We hope you're happy with the plan and we can't wait to get started. Take care. Bye.